In the heart of England, where rolling green hills meet tranquil waters, a discovery of epic proportions lay waiting, hidden for millions of years beneath the surface. This is a story that begins in the quiet countryside, but would soon echo across the globe, capturing the imagination of scientists and the public alike. Rutland Water, a serene nature reserve known for its beauty and wildlife, held a secret beneath its tranquil surface. For decades visitors came to enjoy the peaceful scenery, unaware that something extraordinary was buried deep below, waiting to be revealed. The reservoir itself was created in the 1970s, transforming the landscape and providing a haven for birds and nature lovers. Yet, even as the area flourished above ground, the ancient past remained undisturbed below. In 2021, this secret finally emerged. During routine maintenance work, sharp-eyed workers noticed something unusual in the mud. What they found would soon captivate the world with its sheer grandeur and scientific significance. It was the skeleton of a gigantic sea creature, an ichthyosaur, now affectionately known as the Rutland Sea Dragon. Measuring over 10 meters in length, this ancient marine reptile was a true giant of its time, dominating the prehistoric seas that once covered Britain. This incredible find, the largest and most complete of its kind ever discovered in Britain, sent ripples of excitement through the scientific community. News of the discovery spread quickly, igniting the imaginations of people everywhere and drawing crowds eager to witness history being unearthed. For local residents and visitors, the Rutland Sea Dragon became a symbol of wonder and curiosity. Schools organized trips, and museums prepared special exhibits, all inspired by this window into a world long vanished. The Rutland Sea Dragon's emergence offered a unique glimpse into the distant past, reminding us of the incredible creatures that once roamed our planet. Its perfectly preserved bones told a story of survival, adaptation, and extinction, connecting us to a time when England was submerged beneath a vast tropical sea. It underlined the power of discovery, reminding us that there are still wonders hidden, waiting to be unearthed. Each fossil, each fragment, is a piece of a puzzle that helps us understand the ever-changing story of our world. This incredible find wasn't just about bones and fossils, it was about piecing together the story of our planet and appreciating the magnificence of life that came before us. The Rutland Sea Dragon stands as a testament to the mysteries that still lie beneath our feet, waiting for the right moment to be discovered and shared with the world. To truly grasp the significance of the Rutland Sea Dragon, we must embark on a journey through deep time, far beyond the reach of human memory, to an era when the world was a vastly different place. Picture the Earth over 180 million years ago, during the height of the Jurassic period. The continents were arranged in unfamiliar shapes, the climate was warmer, and the air was thick with the calls of strange ancient creatures. Imagine a world where dinosaurs dominated the land, towering above the ferns and cycads, while the skies were patrolled by flying reptiles. But beneath the surface of the vast primeval oceans, another drama was unfolding. Here the seas were alive with extraordinary marine reptiles, creatures that would have seemed almost alien to us today. This was the Mesozoic Era, a span of time that lasted for nearly 180 million years, encompassing the Triassic, Jurassic, and Cretaceous periods. It was during the Jurassic, in particular, that the ichthyosaurs, one of the most remarkable groups of marine reptiles, reached their peak. These weren't just any reptiles, they were the undisputed masters of the ocean, perfectly adapted to a life spent entirely beneath the waves. Their bodies were built for speed, power, and endurance, allowing them to chase down prey and evade larger predators. Ichthyosaurs, whose name means fish lizards, were marvels of evolutionary design. Their bodies were sleek and torpedo-shaped, much like modern dolphins or tuna, enabling them to slice through the water with incredible efficiency. Some species could reach speeds that rival today's fastest marine animals. Their streamlined forms, powerful crescent-shaped tails and paddle-like limbs work together in perfect harmony, allowing them to maneuver with both grace and precision. These adaptations made them formidable hunters, capable of sudden bursts of speed to ambush unsuspecting prey. As apex predators, ichthyosaurs sat at the very top of the food chain, their jaws were lined with rows of sharp conical teeth, perfect for gripping slippery fish, squid, and even other marine reptiles. Every fossilized tooth is a reminder of their carnivorous lifestyle and their dominance in the ancient seas. 
Now, imagine a creature that looked remarkably like a dolphin but could grow to truly colossal sizes. Some ichthyosaurs even surpassed the length of today's largest whales. These giants were the true rulers of the Jurassic Seas, their legacy preserved in stone for us to discover millions of years later. The story of the Rutland Sea Dragon began not in a laboratory or a museum, but with a man named Joe Davis. Joe, a conservation team leader at Rutland Water Nature Reserve, was carrying out his routine duties in February 2021. As he walked along the edge of a drained lagoon, something extraordinary caught his eye. There embedded in the mud and clay lay a series of large, strange-looking objects. Joe knew he had stumbled upon something special. These weren't just any rocks, these were bones. Big bones. He contacted the local authorities, and soon, experts were called in to examine the site. What they found astonished them. Joe hadn't just found a few scattered bones, he had uncovered the nearly complete skeleton of a giant ichthyosaur. The news of the discovery spread quickly, and for good reason. This wasn't just any ichthyosaur, it was the largest ever found in Britain, a true leviathan of the Jurassic Seas. Measuring a staggering 10 meters long, the Rutland Sea Dragon was a colossal creature, even larger than a double-decker bus. Its skull alone weighed over a ton, a testament to its massive size. This wasn't just a big find, it was a scientifically significant one. The skeleton was remarkably complete, providing paleontologists with an unprecedented opportunity to study this ancient marine reptile in detail. The discovery promised to unlock secrets about the anatomy, behavior, and evolution of these fascinating creatures. Excavating a fossil of this magnitude was no easy feat. It was a delicate and meticulous process, requiring a team of skilled paleontologists and volunteers, led by Dr. Dean Lomax, a renowned ichthyosaur expert, and Nigel Larkin, a specialist fossil conservator, the team worked tirelessly to carefully remove the skeleton from its muddy tomb. Every bone, every vertebra, every tooth was painstakingly documented and extracted. The team used a variety of tools and techniques from small brushes and dental picks to heavy-duty lifting equipment to safely remove the fragile bones from the surrounding rock. It was kind of like assembling a giant jigsaw puzzle with each piece revealing more about the creature's life and the world it inhabited. As the excavation progressed, the team began to piece together the identity of this magnificent beast. Each layer of sediment carefully brushed away revealed more of the creature's story, and the excitement among the paleontologists grew with every new discovery. The sheer size of the bones hinted at an animal unlike any they had encountered before in the region and the distinctive shape of the skull and jawbones began to offer important clues. The team worked meticulously, documenting every detail, knowing that they were uncovering a rare and significant specimen from the ancient past. After careful analysis and comparison with known fossils, they determined that the Rutland Sea Dragon was a species called Temnodontosaurus trigonodon. This formidable marine reptile was one of the largest ichthyosaurs ever discovered, a true apex predator that ruled the Jurassic Seas around 180 million years ago. Its discovery not only shed light on the diversity of life during the Jurassic period, but also provided valuable insights into the evolution of marine reptiles. The Temnodontosaurus was a marvel of adaptation, perfectly suited to its environment, and its presence in the ancient seas would have been both awe-inspiring and terrifying. This species was known for its massive size, powerful jaws, and rows of razor-sharp teeth, all perfectly adapted for hunting prey in the depths of the ocean. Its jaws could deliver a crushing bite, capable of taking down large fish, squid, and even other marine reptiles. The structure of its teeth and jawbones suggests it was a highly efficient predator, able to seize and hold on to slippery prey with ease. The Rutland Sea Dragon's skull was particularly well-preserved, revealing the enormous size of its eyes. These large eye sockets are among the most striking features of the fossil, and they provide important information about the animal's sensory abilities. These massive eyes were a crucial adaptation for hunting in the often murky depths of the Jurassic Seas. With such large eyes the Temnodontosaurus could gather more light, allowing it to track down prey even in low-light conditions where other predators might struggle. This adaptation would have given it a significant advantage, making it one of the most effective hunters of its time. Its teeth, sharp and conical, 
were perfectly designed for grasping and tearing flesh, making it a top predator in its ecosystem. The combination of powerful jaws, keen eyesight, and specialized teeth made Temnodontosaurus trigonodon a true master of the ancient seas, and its fossil remains continue to fascinate scientists and the public alike, offering a window into a world long vanished beneath the waves. The discovery of the Rutland Sea Dragon was more than just finding a big fossil. It provided a unique window into the Jurassic world. By studying the skeleton, scientists could learn about the creature's diet, its environment, and even its possible behavior. The presence of fossilized belemnites, squid-like creatures found near the ichthyosaur's stomach, provided clues about its diet. Chemical analysis of the bones offered insights into the ichthyosaur's environment, confirming that it lived in a warm, shallow sea that once covered much of what is now England. The size and completeness of the skeleton provided valuable data for understanding the growth and development of these ancient reptiles. The Rutland Sea Dragon story is a powerful reminder of the importance of discovery and exploration. It highlights the fact that there are still incredible secrets hidden beneath our feet, waiting to be unearthed. Every fossil find, no matter how small, adds to our understanding of the natural world and our place within it. The Rutland Sea Dragon captured the public's imagination, inspiring a new generation to learn about paleontology and the wonders of the prehistoric world. It reminded us that science is not just about textbooks and laboratories, it's about curiosity, observation, and the thrill of discovering something new. Today, the Rutland Sea Dragon's legacy lives on. Its skeleton, carefully prepared and preserved, stands as a testament to the incredible creatures that once roamed our planet. It serves as a reminder of the vastness of geological time and the constant evolution of life on Earth. The Rutland Sea Dragon story continues to inspire awe and wonder, reminding us that there is still so much to learn about our planet's past. Each new fossil discovery is a piece of a giant jigsaw puzzle, and the Rutland Sea Dragon has provided us with a crucial piece helping us to better understand the incredible diversity of life that has existed on Earth for millions of years. It is a legacy that will continue to inspire and educate for generations to come.